Hello from Lloyd BMW South Lakes. Today we have this 5 Series saloon finished in blue stone metallic uh, with black Dakota leather interior. It's a 520D M Sports so that gives you a 2 litre diesel turbo engine in the uh, front. Uh, being the M Sport, you get the sort of more aggressive uh, front bumpers. This car's fitted with the M Sport Pro Pack, so that gives you these glorious 19 inch diamond cut alloy wheels. It also gives you the uh, privacy glass, gives you this little uh, M spoiler on the back. And when I look inside the car, it also gives you the excellent Harman Kardon sound system as well. So uh, definitely worthwhile. If you're buying a car, get one with the M Sport Plus pack on it. Um, usual features you'd find on five series, obviously electric windows all around. This car's also fitted with the, uh, get that in focus there for you, the folding door mirrors. Said you've got more Harman Kardon speakers, remote release for the boot down there. Uh, interior is this uh, black Dakota leather with the contrast stitching. Being the M Sport, you get the sport seats, so you get the bigger side bolsters, adjustable under thigh support down there as well. The seats are part electric, so most of the seat is electric apart from moving it backwards and forwards is manual. Ah, oh, it's too big. Beside the car. So the car is a 69 plate car. It's covered just less than 26,000 miles, as you can see there. Keyless starts, so it's only got the key on you. Press the start button and the car will come to life. You've got the big satellite navigation screen. Uh, you've also got Bluetooth. You've got uh, DAB radio, etc. up there. Um, it's a touch screen, or most of the times you'll, you'll use the eye controller from down here. Um, and this, uh, you can then do all your little bits and pieces on it. Um, if we go back to nav, if we go back to the map, I'll show you where we are. So if you've not visited our dealership, we're located uh, at the southern end of the Lake District, about 10 minutes off junction 36 of the M6. So uh, if you're passing, feel free to pop in. Coffee machine's always on. Um, coming down, you've got the air vents, you've got favourite buttons, so you can uh, put people's phone numbers, places, stuff like that in there. You've got dual zone climate control, so people, uh, passenger wise, can have a different temperature to the, to the driver show you that. Uh, heated seats, I will turn mine on, it's a little bit chilly today. Uh, the driver can sync the two together as well if they wish. You have this uh, nice uh, sort of aluminium effect uh, trim which uh, carries on through the doors, dashboard and the, uh, the centre console. If I can get in close, you can see it's got a very nice pattern in there. Uh, car's got ambient lighting, so you can see the moment we've set that to blue, but you can have green, purple, orange, uh, white, different colours in there, which is a nice little touch. Inside that tray back, you've got a storage area, you can put your phone in there and charge it using the USB port, you've got a couple of drinks holders, you've got an additional 12 volt supply as, as well. 8 speed automatic gearbox on this car, fantastic gearbox, very very good, just generally leave it alone, it'll sort itself out. If you did want to take uh, more control of the gearbox, you have the option using the uh, paddles mounted to the steering wheel, so you've obviously got upshifts on the right and downshifts on the, on the left there. Uh, traction control buttons down here, different driving modes, uh, parking sensors, electric handbrake with an auto hold function. Armrest, which opens up to give you loads of storage, another 12 volt supply in there as, as well. Um, whilst I mentioned parking sensors, I'll stick it in reverse and you can uh, have a look. So you've got front and rear parking sensors on this car. You've also got uh, the option fitted to this car, which is the rear camera. So uh, uh, this gives you the option to have the obstacle markers and also you've got the guidelines as well. So uh, if I turn the steering wheel, you'll see that the green line moves. So it just doesn't aid really, so if you're backing into a space, you can line the green lines up on that where you want to go, uh, and then you uh, will end up where you where you wanted to go as well. Um, right, steering wheel wise, obviously multifunction steering wheel, so you've got cruise control, you've got speed limit, you've got voice control, you've got Bluetooth activation, you can change radio stations, volumes and stuff like that. Um, digital dashboard, which is quite nice, uh, there's a mileage there, 25,859. Uh, whoops, again focus uh, you've got automatic wipers you've got automatic lights as well central locking buttons on the door as well right I'll just turn it off and I'll show you the rest of the car so as I mentioned you've got privacy glass on the uh, on the rear of the car in a five series you've got loads of space in the back you've got three seat belts across the back the two outer seats have got ISO fix as well so you can put kiddie seats in there 
temperature control, extra storage, storage on the doors, uh, sorry, the seats, storage in the doors as well, electric windows in the back as you'd expect. Nice and easy if you add blue as well, right next to your, your diesel, so that's really easy to, to fill up on this car. Come around the back and you've got the M Sports uh, bumpers, that M Sport spoiler we talked about, the 520D badging, that's your camera that we saw before. Massive boot on the 5 Series, hopefully you can see that. Get in there. You've got a little bit of storage there, but generally just got a really big, big boot. Warning triangle mounted to the bottom of the boot lid there. And so this car's for sale, currently here at uh, Lloyd BMW South Lakes. Um, if it's of any interest, then give us a shout. We can organise any finance figures, uh, test drives, anything like that. In the meantime, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye for now.